Hey, police, I'm go with them. You're not resisting away. them. Because they're Cause you're they're detained for shoplifting. Go over there. I wasn't even, I just paid for it. For what? Take the bag off. Stop. What are you doing? Put your hands behind your back. For what? Heather. Stop Heather, resisting. You're going to catch more hand, charges. He's putting my hands behind my back, Heather. I don't know, bro. Stop. They're embarrassing me. Stop Heather, resisting. come at my kids, please, because they're embarrassing me. I didn't do anything. Sit down. I'm crying. Sit down. You're going to jail. You're doing this. You're acting a fool in front of them. No one's running in Canada screaming. Nobody's coming in here. They're pushing me. Come get my kids. Y'all give me a hug because they don't like black people. Give me a hug. No, you should be embarrassed because you're acting like a shitty parent. No, I'm not. Doing yes, you are. You're stealing in front of your kids and you're going to jail. What's up? What's up? It's your boy once again. With, uh, you know, of course, the foolery. Okay, so this is what I got today. You know, I've been running a couple things about um, cops catching people doing things and people showing out in public and, and just acting a fool. So this episode is two mothers. Two mothers who decide to take their children to Walmart and steal. Yep. Taking... And the crazy thing, one of them even had the kids stealing with her. Like they're a little gang or something. So y'all got to see this in the behavior of the mothers once they get caught. This is the crazy part. How they become the victim once they get caught. So y'all buckle in and y'all check this out. Make sure you hit that subscribe, like, and share. Definitely hit that notification Hit it, hit it, hit it, because that's how you get the next videos that's coming up. So, no further ado, let's check it out. Hey, police, I'm go with them. You're not for resisting what? them, because you're they're detained they're for shoplifting. Go over there. I wasn't even, I just paid for it. Get in the office. I guess, come on. Your ID. I don't have it on me. It's in the car. And I, I don't, okay, I don't even have it. Okay, take the bag off. You're going to lie in there. Take the bag off. For what? Take the bag off. Stop. What are you doing? Put your hands behind your back. For what? Heather. Stop. Heather, because he's trying to put my hands. Charges. He's putting my hands behind my back, Heather. I don't know, bro. Stop. They're embarrassing me. Stop Heather, resisting. come get my kids, please, because they're embarrassing me. I didn't do anything. I'm crying. Sit down. You're going to jail. For what? You're resisting me and them. Sit down. I didn't resist Sit anybody. Down. What are you talking Shut about? Up. I didn't even do anything to resist anything. What the hell? Pour it out. Pour it out. There's nothing in there. Oh, okay. You I didn't pay that for too. that. No, she paid for that. That's the only thing she paid for. Call the people that are in I don't care. Sport, Sit down. My kids can't Sit be down. in here with them. With us. Sit down. Literally, she's Sit crying. Sit down. Call, answer Sit the phone. down. You're doing this. You're acting a fool in front of them. No, I'm not. Yes, I you didn't are. Shut up. In front of them. Shut up. Shut up. Heather, we're on the grocery side by the wine. A client can screaming. Nobody's Kleine coming in here. They're pushing me. Come get my kids. They're doing crazy Found the ID shit to me. Right they're doing crazy shit to me right now. Y'all give me a hug because they don't like black people. Give me a hug. No, you should be embarrassed because you're acting like a shit. Look at that. There's the ID card she said she didn't have. Now, there's a lot in this right now. It started out real wild. I think something happened prior to this, but um, they're both just a little amped up. You know, both of them are. Like the cop quickly throwing the cuffs on her, sit down, shut up, all this. He's losing his professionalism now. But she is acting like, like, what is going on with you? You got your kids there. Now you're worrying about your kids. You're worrying about your kids now, but you see she's about to walk out with a whole buggy full of food. Continue watching. Parent. No, I'm not. Into yes, you are. You're stealing now. in front of your kids and you're going to jail. I, I will get my credit card out and pay for everything right now if you want me to do that. So, but can you please not make my kids stand right here? Like, I, I promise to God, I will do that. If that's it. And it's, it, it always gets me when they... um. Now you worry about the kids seeing this and you want to pay for it. You can't pay after you get caught, people. Come on. 
But it's a lot of mothers, single mothers, go in Walmart to this day with their kids and steal. And then you get caught. See, you better hope you don't call um, Child Protective Service on you. That's the only thing, man. Y'all got to chill with this stuff, man. Y'all, the courts keep giving the kids to the mothers. And this shit keep happening. Issue. It wasn't swipe because it broke or something. Point. Don't cry. It's okay. I did not grab you, bro. I have you on video right here grabbing my arm. You need yeah. to cut my finger. You oh. pushed me. I did oh, not man. touch you. Bro, you have to be in the camera. You grabbed my arm and I never once touched you. And you pushed you. me just right never there. never once touched you. My hands were on my phone and on the car. Can you take them outside, please? We're not going to keep talking. What do you mean? I'm taking this off of you because we're not going to have somebody on the phone while you're under arrest. You're not going to do what? You're not going to do what? I'm sorry? You're not talking to anybody. Okay, I'm sorry. You're not talking to anybody. Why are you acting like that towards me? Like I did something aggressive. I didn't do You are. You're resisting. I didn't resist anything. Okay, both. What did I resist? Okay. We're gonna put stupid. What did I resist though? I'm done talking. Let me know what I resisted. You're just going to jail, it's okay? That's all you need what to do. What did I resist? Okay. If you want me to pay the cash money, I can pay cash instead You're of You're not paying nothing because you had the chance to do it and you didn't. I didn't! Yep. ADP would have gone through! Cool. Yeah. And so you walked out. Look at all that stuff. And she just walked out with it. Watch how she paid, like, pretend to pay for it. The store with all their sh Oh, okay. Excuse me? Can I get the parking truck back? You got your ID on you? Her Sit down. For her parking Sit down. No, Sit down. Because I paid for All right, well. No, I just need I'm not stuff. releasing any property to you unless you're I You're going to do what the f*** they're asking. Hold on, wait. Do Sit down. Because you're pissing me off. At this point, I'm about to resist. At this point. And you're going to get thrown on the ground. Sit, uh, on the ground. Sit down. Oh, wow. Sit down. Send me another unit. Hey, no one showed He just put his hand around my throat. You just, now you he just, just put his hand around my throat. Are you serious? Both of we them were wrong on that part. Also. I didn't do anything. Yeah, you just charged at me. And you I stood me. up like this. Yeah, now you're getting in my face again. But you're taking me to jail anyway. She's being like, wrong she's with you. You're taking me to jail anyway. I don't live in Florida anyway. So you you're I taking, care? you're taking, I don't care. Let me I understand this. Hey, let me understand this. You're going to jail anyway, so add more crimes. Is that what you're doing? <laughs> I'm going to you're jail gonna anyway. More, you're going to be a bitch anyway. You're being a bitch since you walked up to me because I didn't resist anything. You resisted You've been them. You walked away. I didn't resist anything. Yes, I didn't resist anything. Okay. okay. You said police. I turned around. Straight up. I did. Yeah, and then when I put you in handcuffs, you pulled away. You no, I up. did not. Sure. We were already in this room. Sit down. Sit down. I didn't have to walk in this room. Okay. Sit down. What do you mean? Shut the fuck up and sit down. Don't tell me to oh. shut the fuck up. Sit down. Let's see, right there. Yeah, it's a lot going on, but the police also has to be the professional. You can't say stuff like that. You're going to lose. You're going to lose. I'm telling you. Yeah, she's amped up. She's all up. You should just wait for your backup to come because you seem like you can't handle the girl. And whoever this Walmart girl in here, she don't need to amp it up anymore. She need to sit down, let the officer handle this, and that's it. Those Some people try to do too much. Now, she's, she's way out of control now. I'm not giving her no credit whatsoever. She's, she's doing way too much when you know you're wrong. That's the thing I can't understand. You wrong. But the officer, you can't be wrong with her. You can't be all this losing your professionalism, telling people to shut the elf up and all this other stuff. It ain't going to work, man. Sit down. Like, Kill why do you want to go Kill through me. all that? Kill me. Kill me. I have to Watch get out. Ryan. I just need... Oh, Lord. Falling on the ground. Yourself. Shut the f up, cause you racist or something, bro. You aggressing me the whole time. Let's go. Record everything. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
down. Record everything. Calm down. Get in the car. Did you record him dragging me? Get in the car. Get in the car. Cool, get come come record this, yeah. Come record her resisting. Cause you're talking to me doing crazy out. Oh. Stop kicking me. Oh. Oh. Stop pushing me to this! Get in the car! Let me get in! <sighs> Woo. I would have told this girl here, will you please suck sit yourself down somewhere? <laughs> Stop following me. I think you're racist. No, you are. Because I didn't do anything until you aggressively handed me. Okay. They didn't do nothing until you aggressively handed and me. And then you kicked me in the face. Nothing. I didn't kick you. Okay. She was hitting me and pulling me and sliding me on the ground. What do you mean? Yeah, because you deadweighted. You're resisting are again. You serious? Yep. Where is my shit? Where is my stuff? Where is my stuff? Heather, they won't give me my stuff! They won't give me my stuff, God. Heather! Can I talk to you real second? No. Retail merchant. So. Okay, um, so four different charges? Because yeah. we leave in three days, so how is that? I, I, she I may not be, be going. Her, I wouldn't be able to uh, give her a citation if she was cooperative because she's not from around here. Because she's not from around yeah. here? She's from Texas. Okay. So it's going to be longer than three days, is what you're saying? It could be. I mean, I don't know. She'll, have, so she'll see a judge in the morning. Oh, okay. In the morning. So far. Yeah, can you just stand by with her? She is violent, so um, I gotta go in there. She's got family here. I gotta collect some evidence. So. Who else? Just check right here. Her and there was another gentleman here, and then she had two children. So I put her in handcuffs, and she's like, she's like, I'm already going to jail. She just stands up, hits in my face, pushes me with her chest, and I'm like pushing her back down. So I drag her out here. I'm like, all right, and she dead weights and then kicks me in the face while we're back here. Nice. Yeah, she kicked me when I got her out in the car. You okay? Now, all this, I, I still don't get it, man. I don't understand it. I just don't get it with some of y'all. It's like she just went ballistic. And then the cop realized he got more than he can handle on his hands. He got this crazy chick just falling. And guys, just because you cuff and you fall down, they can pick you up. They can drag you a little bit. No, to get you in that car. It can happen. So all this falling down and screaming and friends recording. See, I, she can be recording, but it can be against you. That's the thing. So, I don't know, man. That's a lot. Where is it at? Right here. I'll have to take a picture. What did she do? How did that happen? She, like, at this point right here where I'm right here, I have a hold of the buggy, and then she grabs a hold of my wrist. When she does it, my finger gets sliced by the buggy. She was like a mother. <laughs> you want videos of her resisting? We the world of the haircut. She got a mullet. If you could save all of that, oh, yeah. she has a mullet. A mullet. Yeah. And she admitted to everything. I didn't have to read her Miranda. She said she admitted to stealing. She admitted to the battery. She was doing it. And she was. Good job, man. Yeah, no. I, just, I don't understand. Like, she's like, get get my kids out of here so she can act a fool even more. It's always funny to watch the quality control people. They swear they police officers. They try to act like they police so 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 much. 
It's like they can't even grab you or manhandle you or anything. They can't. If they do it, they know they're getting ass knocked down or, or they're getting arrested themselves or sued. But they just have to report, call the police and report. That's it. All this extra she's doing, she don't have to do all that. She ain't have to do all that. Arguing back with the girl in there and all that stuff. See, she's, she's not supposed to do all that. She wants to keep a part of her trespasser, too. If she well, I roll, to let me roll down the window so you can uh, just tell her not welcome hey, back on the property. So you're not going to be allowed back one year. I don't about you telling me nothing. I, I, I appear to buy You've been trespassed. I don't think so. Can you just go ahead and, like, just refresh my mind? Okay. So she, she was tried to pay with the EBT. Yeah. So she's at the self-check. Yeah. She scanned stuff. She was concealing stuff under the bags. Okay. They, she had the, them cancel it. They went to a register where she only paid for the Dr. Pepper and, and then walked out. Okay. And when I was over there, she grabbed, like, she grabbed my arm and... Can I take a picture yeah. of your... Uh, I have to go home. It's fine. She grabbed your this arm. She grabbed this arm and pushed out. Little finger. Okay. Girl, ain't nobody do that fat ass weight. I got video. <laughs> Just give it to them. I'm not giving them any. You don't need to take it to jail. Okay. Well, I can't take it all to jail, so it'll be turned in this property. You can't do that. I sure can. Do you Please want me to hang out here until Please you're done? I should be fine. She's just going to be Please gone. Please the whole car needs to go. I can't. I, I don't have enough. Listen, I don't know if I'm okay with releasing the car, but I have to know who you are, at least. Well, I know I'll give you everything. Okay, that's why I was asking you over there. No, no, that's why I was like, I'm not releasing anything. I, don't have my ID. I wonder if there's something in that car. And maybe in that purse, too. But, I mean, he looked in it, but she is, like, really screaming, like, I need to get my stuff, get my stuff, like, panicky. So I was, I keep wondering, like, is it something in that purse or definitely in that car? So, mm. Unless all her baggage, you know, they traveling. So unless that might be it, all her suitcases and clothes and stuff might be in there. What's your name? Heather. Heather oh. what? I, I kind of get now why she want her kids out, because so she can act up and resist arrest in front of her, is without it being in front of her kid at least. Our kids here? They were here, and then she was like, "Yeah, let them, let them go." I let them go, and then she starts resisting. That's you said I resisted before, so what do yeah. you mean? You said I resisted before, so what is it? So you resisted a retail merchant. You are literally That's, lying on. Okay, me. and then you resisted arrest, okay. and then you resisted arrest out here, and then okay. you battery leo when you got in my car, kicked me in the face. Okay. Yeah, it's it's my fault that you stole, right? You admitted to stealing before I even got you in the office. Make sure you turn in that camera. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's gonna be turned in. Is the groceries that she bought is that being kept? She didn't buy anything but a Dr Pepper. She bought. She, she only stole has everything. Thing on her seat, receipt? Yeah, she. So what? Here's her purse. Thank you. I'm, the, the I, I cannot release. I, I just want you to understand. I cannot release anything I, if I don't know who you are. It don't make any sense. No, it's cool. And then she comes back after me like she's been doing this whole well, time yeah, and says, "Oh, it's issues. it's we stolen. That. That's, it's that's stolen." It. See, it never fails. The friend snitches. Look at her. oh, she has anger problems. It happens all the time. People, y'all need to be careful who you're hanging around. She just done jumped on the cop side already. Done told on you. Well, I'm just letting you know my point of view. It's stolen, and then she tries to come after the police department while I handed it to you, but I never got your name. And then they look at me like I'm the stupid. Right, 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 yeah. Gotcha. So she went to a register. She scanned everything. There was an issue, and then they voided the transaction. She uh. went to another register where she was supposed to ring everything up, okay. where she only pays for a Dr. Pepper, and then she walks straight out the door. Before I got here, they tried to confront her, and then she tried to walk away from them. And then that's when she started this whole fiasco. So. Okay. This is everything I need, though, right? This is all her stuff she had with her? Yep. Okay, cool. And then you said one more time. The county? The Scamby County, Joe. The Scamby. You all remember that? The Scamby. The Scamby. Oh, Scamby. Oh, Scamby. Scamby. What in the world? She got tattoos on her legs. A tattoo on the back of her leg. Y'all just... Be... One more time. The county? The She's Scamby doing county. anything. The Scamby. You all remember that? The Scamby. Oh, the Scamby. Look at this. All right. You know you're gonna look old. I mean, you get old, you're gonna look like. Look at this. Scambia. Oh, Scambia. 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 Sorry. Scambia. Love you.
Ariel was charged with battery on a peace officer, resisting with violence, larceny, resisting the recovery of stolen property and battery. She posted bond totaling $5,000, indicating she was released two days later. Court records indicate she recently entered a plea of no contest to the five charges since all her actions were caught on camera. As part of the plea, if she stays out of trouble, she will likely avoid any felony conviction. How can you get past a felony conviction doing all that? Okay, so this one, this is the one that takes the cake. This mother here think it was okay to use her kids, again, to go steal in Walmart food when she gets a food card, EBT card. Why do these women keep stealing when they're giving you free money, as they say? I don't get it. I just don't get it. But let's get it. And the merchandise is in that cart. Uh, both these carts, so. chips, drinks. Okay. And, uh, mm -hmm. This is a woman who's not only comfortable stealing thousands Look of dollars worth of food, have. but is also happy to make her kids do it for her. Yeah, there's two people? Yeah, it appears to be a minor. It's the woman's second time at the store today, but this time she's brought her four children along for the ride to help her. Only she's got no idea that everything she's doing has been recorded, and she and her entire family are about to be cornered and arrested by the cops. Everybody stole something, with the exception of the baby. So you are going <laughs> Oh it was the 14th of January 2023, and cops were made aware of an active shoplifting incident at a Target in Florida. Apparently, the suspect had filled a cart up with over $1,000 worth of food items and used her baby's stroller to cover up the stolen groceries. But when the cops arrived, they found out that she had multiple accomplices, and they should have been the last people that she'd ever want to drag into this. Let's all go back inside. Okay. Let's all go back inside. They were with me. Okay, well, they're accusing you guys of shoplifting, so can we head back inside, or do I need to just start putting people in cuffs out here? It's crazy, because she got the baby with her, and the girl is pushing a stroller, but then put food in the damn, I mean, sorry, in the stroller. <laughs> yeah, I'm working on it. But she put the food in the stroller, in the car, and they trying to walk out. Like, come on. Okay. Nope, everybody inside. Initially, when the cop arrived, the mother actually tried to walk off, almost using her own kids as decoys to let her get away. Thankfully, the officer didn't let this happen, and threatening arrest, managed to get the entire family back inside for further investigation. But surprisingly, the suspect made the cop's job much easier than he was expecting by immediately confessing. Is there a reason why they would be accusing you guys of shoplifting? They got two okay. carts and, stuff. and okay. a stroller. I appreciate it. How old are you guys? They're minors. They're all minors? Yes. Okay. Mom, I'm not talking to these cops. Okay. I don't want to get any more trouble than I'm already in. The cop reads everyone their Miranda rights, and the mother begins to break down, realizing she's not only in big trouble herself, but she's just incriminated all three of her children. But her kids aren't taking this anywhere near as seriously as she is, implying crazy. this isn't out of the ordinary for them whatsoever. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can be used against you in court. Do you understand each of these rights? I need to have a verbal yes or no from each one of you, ma'am. Yes. Yes. Camo. Yes or no. Do you understand? Yeah. Your, do you know these? Understand your rights. Yes. Hollister. Yes. Ma'am. Yes. Are you willing to talk with me? Yes or no. You've already said no, but I have to ask again. Yes or no. Sure. That's have my choice since I'm already in trouble with court. So they're gonna no. put this on my record too. Do you guys have IDs on you? I'm 16. Okay. I'm okay. You said you've been in trouble with court. What for? Fighting. 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 Whenever. See, I don't get it, man. I really, truly don't get it. They, the courts will give the kids to these mothers. And all these acts getting are taking place in the custody of the mothers. She got four minors with her. She even got the baby, the, new, the newborn. Got the baby in there, stealing in the baby stroller. Got her three teenage daughters stealing, talking back to the cops. Got other charges on them. I mean, it's all messed up. 
all messed up. She just keep making babies. Kids as young as 14 are involved in violent crime. There are always questions of why they took this route and how they got into the wrong side of the law so young. But in this situation, that question has already been answered for us. And instead, we're left wondering how this woman could be so callous and incompetent to enlist her kids' help in her own crimes. That's how kids this young end up on probation and back in the arms of the law once again. But it turns out, they are not the only people involved. And another cop heads outside to speak with their getaway driver. Do you have an idea on you? I sure do. <laughs> what are you guys up to today? Nothing really. I, I, I gave her money earlier today. Yeah. So I thought, you know, that she was going in. She says, I need help because I can't put all yeah. the drinks with the kids. Because okay. I get over $1,000 food stamps. Yeah. And then she gets her food stamps. She gets like four or 500 too. So mm -hmm. I thought with that, and then I pay her because she stays with me. I didn't expect. She lives with the mother, gets 400 in food stamps, and the mother gets 1,000 in food stamps. And you're in Walmart stealing food. So you know what they do with this, the, the money, the value of these cars, they sell it. Everybody know that's the old school. They sell the car, I mean, the food, whatever. And they trying to save the money on the car I guess by stealing in Walmart. But like I said before, once you get caught stealing food and you have a food card, they should take your card away. They should take it. You get caught with any, well, as a matter of fact, if you want anything, governor assistant, and you get caught something like this, they should take that from you. There should be something in there that states you can't get in trouble. No thefts, felonies, certain things. No tickets, something like that, that, that's not one of the things. But if you're in a store stealing, especially something like food items, and we're giving you a food card, it makes no sense. This to happen. It seems like this woman wasn't expecting to be roped into doing this today and was just acting as a driver for some regular, fully legal grocery shopping. However, she did mention something interesting. Every month, she's given around $1,000 in food stamps and mentioned that the woman inside is also given several hundred dollars to use. It totals around $1,400 between the pair, easily enough to get by on, but the suspect still feels the need to steal. Many crazy. elderly people are given less than $10 a week in stamps to survive on and would be extremely grateful for so much financial assistance. But instead, it's used on this woman who instead takes advantage of it and ends up crying in front of a cop surrounded by her kids. Hey, can I request a crim hist on the adult female? Did you file that already? I've not filed this one yet. Two or three days ago? Okay. The cops spent the next few minutes combing through security footage and totaling up the stolen items before they finally moved in to arrest the woman. Mm. The suspect was taken to jail where she was charged with grand theft and sentenced to five months probation. However, clearly she didn't learn her lesson as she was rearrested the very next month for the exact same thing after attempting to steal a further $500 worth of groceries. Guys, ladies, come on. Somebody is getting this woman pregnant. She got four kids. Somebody is really getting this woman pregnant, and evidently something's wrong with her. Is she just hooked on stealing or just hooked on phonics? I don't know, but I think it's the second thing. So I just can't get past how the government keep giving all this money and stuff away to people that don't work. And us that work, and even the seniors who have worked all their life now in Social Security can't get anything. Seniors don't get nothing. They get probably like $40 worth of uh, what they call food stamps or EVT or food ration, whatever you want to call it. Maybe $100, $200 in Social Security, maybe $600 in Social Security. That's it. But these people, y'all give them free housing. Y'all even give them cell phones now. Food card, four to, what someone told me, this lady said, you get 300 per child. So she gets more than $400 because she still got those minors. So she got four kids. So she probably get close to $1,200 herself in food stamps. 
but you're in Walmart still. That's crazy. Well, guys, y'all let me know in the comments what y'all think about this. Um, what y'all think? I think if once you get caught stealing something like this, your, your, your assistance should be taken, at least the food cart. I know y'all think about the kids, but the mom need to think about the kids. All right? And it's your boy, and up out of here. Make sure y'all hit me in the comments. Make sure y'all like the video, and that's how you support me. And it's your boy, and I'm up out of here. Y'all take care. Peace.